I'm going to be showing you the football hold, which is a very good hold for moms who've had C-sections because it doesn't put any pressure on the abdomen. And if you do have any nipple damage, then this is a nice way, too, to move the baby's mouth to a different position so as not to damage or let heal the part that's already been damaged. So with this position, you're going to want to have good support on your side because you're going to bring the baby's bottom around next to your side and basically put his or her legs up behind you so that he's almost sitting horizontally. You're going to take this arm and put it under your breast, and you can hold down this arm with your other hand. And you're going to support the baby's head here underneath, like we talked about in the cross cradle position, so that you can guide him or her onto the breast easily. So in this position, his mouth is horizontal. So I'm going to compress my breast more like a sandwich this time. And as soon as he opens his mouth wide, guide him onto the breast like so. Let me show you that again. So I'm going to compress the breast horizontally. And as soon as his mouth is open wide, I'm going to guide his head onto the breast like so. And this is the football position. The other thing that you can do with football is if your hand gets tired here, you can either prop your pillow up a little bit higher or get a rolled up washcloth and just put it underneath your hand for support. And babies like this too. And then when they're done on this side, you can just move the baby over. Put his legs up behind you and feed him on this side.